We wondered how much it costs taxpayers for the House to repeal the law again and again. That comes to a little under $50 million. You can't deny coverage due to pre-existing conditions, can't charge women more than men, can't place a lifetime dollar limits on care. Insurance companies can't cancel your policy if you get sick. Young adults up to 26 can stay on their parents' plan, the prescription drug donut hole will be filled, and there are tax credits for individuals and small businesses.